All right, guys, we're downtown here on 20. Twenty Second Street and Twenty Third Street for Transformer Fire. It's doing some heavy gurgling. There's a lot of traffic here. The manhole is very angry. It's snowing very heavy. So all things are, look at this guy, lovely. All things are very hectic right now. Try to go on the other side. Transformer. Can't really see what it really is, but it looks like a manhole to me or a little longer, I'm not sure. They just spread a lot of salt today for the snow and that's what aggravates these manholes when the uh, runoff of salt snow melts and the runoff water goes into the manhole and some of the cables are exposed and old. Gotta check all the buildings and surrounding properties for CO readings. One chopper, three chopper, my good. everything in there. You might even blow up.
the heavy snow is not helping anything either. I'll show you up there how heavy it's snowing. I think I got water in the lens. getting going or he's gonna be running out of fizz soon there's not much they could do until Con Ed gets here <coughs> Shut down 8th Avenue. The members are checking all the buildings for extension. This building looks like it might have lost power. I'm not sure. There should be some lights on in there. <clears throat> taking up. We'll see what the team does. Well, this stinks. The battalion's talking, but the radios are screwy. Members continue to check the buildings. a little bit uh, you guys have seen these before this one's very active like I said but he seems to be subsiding a tiny bit
up now. Next available crew for Con Ed. Snow on the lens. Hold on. All right, I moved back over here because um, the smell is awful. It's going all over the place. And uh, also, he's doing a lot of revolutions. So sometimes, like, they blow up and the top goes flying. <clears throat> I want to get smashed with that. Look at this guy. He went right through the police tape. Right through the police tape. Uh, oh, and I checked the building. It still has electricity. lightening up in terms of color sometimes they burn out and they don't have enough uh, salt going in there I don't know so you got the several police cars uh, I think three engines and maybe two ladders uh, at some point, they make a decision to wait for Con Ed all together, or um, <coughs> oh, they flood them on their own. We got light smoke condition building in 300 again. Yeah, 10 4. Make your way into the electrical room. 10-4, there's a uh, same condition, light smoke condition in the electrical room. Uh, he's in one of the buildings and they're getting light smoke condition. Pushing into the building, basement. Sometimes these manholes are connected to electrical Nine, seven, 12, show, rooms uh, and NCO. stuff. Uh, 10-4, you on the CO. Sometimes they're square like this, and this is the one that I think they call transformer. That right there. But I'm not really sure. And then you have the manhole. Look at this guy walking right next to the manhole. Yay! <clears throat> wow, this one's the stinkiest one that I ever smelled. It's very choky, too. The smoke is going all over the place. Here, yeah, look. Look up there. Uh, 
Mass Paul Lombok, 438. in the truck and they're gonna await the direction of the chief and however long Con Ed takes. still checking the surrounding properties for CO. A lot of them are zero, which is good. <clears throat> Considering all the smoke this thing is spewing, there should have been some reading somewhere. Uh, so far, they only got a little bit of smoke pushing a haze inside one of the basements. Uh, we were hanging around over there um, 
the manhole started flaming uh, big time. So we're gonna go back over here and get a little bit of that. Sorry, what the hell? Manhole fire. Manhole. Let me see. Yeah, he's completely engulfed in flames right now. So we're going to do a little bit more filming until he... Um... Now he's really on fire. So let me give you a little recap. Uh, they got the engine standing by uh, and the ladder, two ladders, three engines still. The chief is awaiting uh, Con Ed, as I stated uh, several times before. And uh, whether they want it to be flooded, etc., etc., you know, this, you know, the deal. You guys have seen this before. So, Con Ed authorizes it to be flooded if they want it, or they cut the uh, power, blah, blah, blah stuff like that that's how they do that <clears throat> engine AK G76 yeah, uh, south of the end the night chief 31 for 10 I don't understand if that's Con Ed or private contractor. I don't know, that's weird. Oh, they have to wait for another unit.
got a little bit of blue and green flames in there too. Alright guys, sorry to make this video so long. Uh, we're going to be taking up from here. It's getting late. The manhole still doing the same thing. Con Ed has a lot of these going on in the city. So it's going to be a long time before they get here. And uh, what's funny is that they have a Con Ed crew. <clears throat> Let me show you where the Con Ed crew is. There's a Con Ed crew working here <clears throat> on another manhole. So I don't know if those guys could come here. I don't know if the dispatchers, how this all works, who's doing what, but that's Con Ed working in a manhole there. And they've been there since this situation started or before, way before. And um, this is going on over here. So I don't get it. Uh, So we're going to be taking up. And uh, keep on trucking. Look at all the smoke. It's getting unbearable. It's getting in my lungs. I already have enough problems coughing all the time. So they got another manhole going on uptown. So we'll be uh, bouncing around two and two. We're going to see you all on the other side from the uh, Chelsea area of Manhattan at 8th Avenue and 23rd Street.